Hello guys, today we're gonna see how to install Ghost Vector. It's really easy. First of all, go to this website. I'll leave the link in the description, of course. Here you'll find Windows 10 Ghost Vector with the latest version, which is 24. Just click download and then the download again. It will take you here. There is three servers to download them. I recommend the pixel one because it's kind of fast so just click the link and it will take you to this page as you can see it's windows 10 update 24 this is ghost specter modified iso so just download it i already have it so i won't be doing it again and next we're gonna need 7zip this is a small app that can really help you with unzip it so we download it like this it's like about one megabyte it's really light and we're gonna open it and install it just like that it's done let's go to the ISO we download it and then right click it and 7-zip choose 7-zip and then extract now while we wait extraction to be done we're gonna go and get another app it's called rufus we're gonna need rufus to burn the windows into the usb and make it uh, bootable there we go this is the interface of rufus you have the usb here which is 32 gigabytes we're gonna select the iso file Get we got earlier. There it is. Now here for partition, you're gonna find either GPT or MBR to check which one is yours. We're gonna go to the start and search disk manager. Click enter. We're gonna come to the main disk, your PC. Right click it and then properties. And head to volumes, and there you're gonna find it. It's either GPT or MBR. If you find GPT here, then select it in Rufus. So it's GPT, I'm gonna leave it GPT for my case, and then we're gonna start. Check the disable collection data, and then OK. OK again, and then OK again. The USB is going to be formatted, so watch out for your data. Back them up if you need it. And then you're going to let it until it's complete. Now that it's completed, just turn off your PC and then boot it. And then use one of these keys here to access the boot menu. In my case, I have Dell PC, so I'm going to click F12. So this is my boot menu, I'm gonna click the USB flash disk. You can use arrows in your keyboard up and down and then enter, click enter. So this is installation wizard, we're gonna click the icon of windows here, and this will appear. Choose your language and then next. If not all the versions appear to you like this, just two. If you're looking for super light edition just go back like this and then click next next again and then I don't have a product key for now as you can see all the versions are available now I'm gonna choose Windows 10 Pro super light for this tutorial and if you need Windows Defender just collect versions that have plus DEF which is Defender but for me I'm not gonna do that I'm just gonna stick to super light normal I accept license terms next custom install windows only choose this option to fresh installation and then you're gonna delete all the partition delete I'm gonna delete all of them to to make fresh windows installation 
this is my main disk it's 256 ssd now i'm gonna click new and then apply and then i'm gonna format all the partitions before you click next make sure to click the primary partition which is this one now just wait for the installation to be completed and then windows will be rebooted automatically that's it guys now we have successfully installed ghost specter super light edition windows 10 and this is the toolbox ghost toolbox you can basically use this to download anything you need on your pc